<laughs> you gotta take it off mute. <laughs> you know, I got another one. You know, okay, you nothing but respect for Shug because that before or after you took all the properties. <laughs> hey, yeah, hold on. That nigga said me, me and Snoop is cool. You know, he watched my podcast. <laughs> you up there posting pictures of his wife? We yeah. got nothing to do with nothing. Right. right, and threatening to put more up, too. Right, and then you too. turn around and say, you a big Suge Knight defender? You have been dragging Suge for the last three years. Yo, you said he killed Biggie with Poochie. Yeah. With Poochie, Russ was Poole was right. He, you know, that's a video that'll go down in infamy. Russ Poole was right. Russ Poole was right. Suge <laughs> killed him. Yeah, he did. They shout out, as Kimmy would say, shout out to Vlad TV on that one. Right. You know, can't take that shit down. Of course, that'll be a video that'll come down at some point. That's all right. I'm so somebody got a copy of it. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Now he's a Suge Knight defender. Let's start there. Yeah, that's right. I still defend Suge to the to the T. And <clears throat> I was around when Snoop uh and, and the things and the stress that Suge went through to help save Snoop from prison. Let I don't quote, feel let me, let me quote something for a minute. I got your house, I got your family, I got where your kids live, where little Suge lived, I got your house, everything, Reggie's name. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, you're a big defender, all right, dude. I could tell that was that was a video. Boy, oh boy. Yeah, you call me security, but I got everything. Yeah, that that's a defender all day long, man. With friends like that, who needs freaking enemies? She right. This dude right here is a trip, bro. I got your house, little chug live. I got everything. Everything Reggie's name. Everything. And you notice he gets all squinty eyed when he does that too. He has two expressions: dopey eyed like this, and then <laughs> squinty eyed when he gets like he goes when he's when he's your boy homie Reggie. He's like like this, and then he gets all squinty eyed when he wants to make threats. He goes, "Yeah, your kids run around on IHSS and." Everything in Reggie's name, Reggie's name. And he gets that squinty ass look on his face, you know, like he just <laughs> ate some prunes or something, you know. But there's definitely two expressions when you see. So you don't see that side of him right now because he ain't threatening anybody. But when he wants right. to threaten somebody. Oh, it's coming. It's coming. Oh, is it okay? Good. Because that's oh, yeah. when you're going to see, mark my words, because I ain't seen this video. You're going to see them slitty eyes. You're going to have that, like, Chinese oh, yeah, yeah, eyes yeah, come it, out. It's Chinese definitely eyes. coming. Yeah. Okay, good. Let's see it. Snoop did the same thing to help Suge when he was facing a prison sentence as far as the financing and the backing. Yeah. And so took his that, company, right? <laughs> um, <laughs> you do and say, I still defend Suge to the to the T. And <clears throat> I was around when Snoop uh, and, and the things and the stress that Suge went through to help save Snoop from prison. I don't feel Snoop did the same thing to help Suge when he was facing a prison sentence. As far as the financing and the backing, yeah, and so took his that, company, right? <laughs> and, well, and that ain't his fault. That ain't his fault, you know, uh, uh, of the company and all of that. So I, I prefer Snoop to have the company yes. if he owns it. I'm not. I'm confused. I lost. Uh, take take off your mute. I'm I missed something there. Sh Snoop, Snoop was supposed to somehow pay for Shug's defense. Right, that and they don't they don't even mess with each other after all the threats and all the stuff they went through, and I, I'm telling you, she, she don't don't mind her. She don't she don't know. No, she just listening. She yeah. just listening. That's yeah, okay. but he yo he what like why why would Snoopy paying for uh at that time paying for anything for sure? Yeah, that because no was, I mean that was right after that was within months after Tupac got shot and Suge was already there. I want to know who dropped the dime to his parole officer and told him that he was out of the country to violate his pro probation. That's uh, what I wanted. I want to know who that was. Was that was Snoop? Professor X? Yeah, was that Snoop that did that? No, that you was know. Professor X who did that. Yeah, ha you know, had to be somebody who knew where he was. H yeah. Him and Kenna. Wow. All right, roll it. One that's gonna say he owns it, I think he's a front man. But if he is the outright owner of it, I ain't got no problem with that. I'd rather him than somebody else having it, to be honest. Mm. Yeah, 
But most people don't know everything is over there that's pretty much left with any value is it's new stuff. Pac and the estate, the Tupac estate has all the Tupac stuff, and Dre has the chronic. <laughs> No, they do not. They do not. They sued Death Row three different times over getting master tapes that they weren't given. They kept playing games with them and holding master tapes away from them. They found master tapes out in Detroit. They had a deal. Death Row had a deal to put out one Tupac album that had nine tracks on it. And that Tupac album, what they had their pick of nine different Tupac tracks to put out, to put out their own unique Tupac album. Not only did they never do it, but it became the subject of litigation twice before the bankruptcy and then during the bankruptcy and shortly after the bankruptcy. They kept saying, I mean, that bankruptcy was like in what, 2006, 2007? Ten years go by and the estate still, where the fuck is our tapes? Where's our tapes? They don't, you know. They, they, don't, they, they leaking them out. We see oh, the yeah, leaks. Well, they, yeah, they were all, John, John had, John Bomb first had them all leaked out by the time that uh, that happened. And I got the receipts on that, too. Yeah, they, they, yeah, yeah. There's no death. There's, there's nothing in death row because you leaked it all out. Right. That's why. Yeah. So only thing left is doll pound and and Snoop stuff. Okay. So so, so um, I know that you watch Collect Calls with Suge Knight. Yes, ma'am. Um. Did you hear? We about missing one. We about one about do. I hope one come out today so I can have some content for next week. I've been looking. I've been looking. Yeah, yeah, he's about to. Yeah, because he got nothing. Yeah, um, he insinuated some things on there about Snoop. Yeah, that's just been a little bitter. I don't believe. I'm not one to say Snoop had anything to do with the death of Tupac. I am not a conspirator. People that says that believe that in my mind are conspirators. Uh -huh. that, that's like the people that say Tupac is a lie. I think it's very disrespectful <laughs> and all of that. Tupac Shakur died for some gang banging activity that unfortunately went down inside the MGM that led on to the strips of Las Vegas. You're not gonna get anything else out of me. That's what I believe. I will go, I would bet my the rest of the limbs that work on my body that that's what happened. What, oh. So you don't think? I mean, so what? Which was it? Was it a that ain't much of a bet, or was it? It retaliation. That's the question that I sent in right there. Since he keeps saying that, he told Greg Caden that um, Biggie got killed because. It was retaliation from Southside for not getting their money on the hit for Tupac, right? So he just said just now, Tupac died from some gang banging for messing with some joints. So now she asked the question that I submitted, right? Okay. Was it, did he die from a hit or did he die from retaliation for jumping on the wrong motherfucker? Watch this. That's pretty much left with any value is it's new stuff. Pac and the estate, the Tupac estate has all the Tupac stuff, and Dre has the chronic. <laughs> so only thing left is doll pound and, and snoop stuff. Okay, so. so so um I know that you watch Collect Calls with Suge Knight. Yes, ma'am. Um did you hear we about missing one? We about one about do. I hope one come out today so I can have some content for next week. I've been looking. <laughs> I've been looking. Yeah, up. yeah, he's right. about do. Yeah, um, he insinuated some things on there about Snoop. Yeah, that's just been a little bitter. I don't believe I'm not one to say Snoop had anything to do with the death of Tupac. I am not a conspirator. People that says that believe that in my mind are conspirators. Uh -huh. that, that, that's like the people that say Tupac is a lie. I think it's very disrespectful <laughs> and all of that. Tupac Shakur died for some gang banging activity that unfortunately went down inside the MGM that led on to the strips of Las Vegas. That all you're not gonna get anything else out of me. That's what I believe. That I will all could have been avoided. I'll that all could have been avoided. Leave that part in. I would bet 
my the rest of the limbs that work on my body that that's what happened. What, oh, so you don't think? I mean, so what? Which was it? Was it a hit or was it retaliation? Retaliation for them assaulting. Uh, that's why I call it game. Remember what I told you about his eyes. Look at his eyes. Look at his eyes. Banging activity that unfortunately went down inside the MGL that led on to the strip for Las Vegas. You're not going to get anything else out of me. That's what I believe. I will go. I will bet. Lie. My, the rest of the limbs that work on my body, that that's what happened. What? Oh. So you, do you don't understand think, I mean, what a so you what, understand what a silly it? statement that is. I bet the rest of the limbs on my body. I know he's trying to be funny and cute, but that's like a 95 year old man saying I'm willing to take a life sentence. OK, <laughs> right. that ain't much of a bet. That's like betting with your last dollar when you right. say whatever he got left at functions, he's willing to bet. I know he's trying to be cute, maybe play the sympathy card a little bit. But, man, I would be betting a little bit more than that if I was that serious about what I had to say. Then, you right. know whatever whatever you got functioning left man right. now now listen to his response 